My brothers, I'm telling you, you can be the simplest person. But Allah, if you're good with Allah right now, if you made a good tawbah, Allah will tell you when your death is coming before the death comes to you. I'm giving you an incident just happened one year ago in North London. A brother called Shazad, 89-year-old man. He phoned his family and he says this to his family. He's living on his own. And he says what? He says to his family members, he says, just now, I had a person who came in my house without knocking on the door. And he said to me, he's the angel of death. And he said to me, have I got a last thing to do before I leave this world? And I said to him, I love to do wudu and pray two rakats. I love to do wudu and pray two rakats. So he did wudu, he prayed two rakats. He did his salam and he didn't see the person there in his house. He never heard anyone leaving. These guys, his family members, they thought, Buddha Baba Thora, old man has lost it a bit. They took him to their house. Exactly after three days, the person passed away. Exactly after three days, the person passed away. Subhanallah, this, there's a, another incident. Ex just, I'm giving, this person was a common person, no scholar, no alim, no one. In England, I think this, this was particularly in either Kent or some place near Kent. I can't remember, there is a masjid in one of the parts there, Monan Abdul Wahid, who passed away. Not this Ramadan, the Ramadan before that. Where he passed away, he knew that it was going to be his passing away. He told, he told his family members and he, he, he wasn't feeling well. And tell the brothers, take me to the bedside because I'm not feeling well. I, these are my last moments. He knew. There was a brother, there's a brother in North London who to, tells me about his father. He was, a, he was a sheikh and he actually on his day of going, he told people, he went to the masjid for Juma in Bangladesh. And this is a brother I've known for many years, so I, I, there's no reason for me to distrust him. And he said to me, after I narrated this to him, he said that his father went to the masjid for Jumu'ah and he said to people, Oh people, if I've hurt anyone, please forgive me, for this is my last day of my life. And they thought, he's something wrong. He then went to the graveyard and told people, he said, when I die, you will bury me exactly here. He went to his home and then he went around his whole house and his land. He said, this is the last time I'm seeing my land. That night he passes away. 